hit me hard. It could have been my son. <laughs> Jessica Avendano is worried for the safety of her teenage son. He often goes to Unity Park. That's where a classmate of his from Cesar Chavez High School was shot and killed just last week. That's why she spoke out at Monday night's public safety town hall hosted by city leaders, Stockton Police and the school district. Avendano wants police to have more of a presence. The hot spots were before school ends, like Chavez and Edison, and they should be around there when there's big crowds of kids. Dozens of people voiced their concerns, especially after last week's deadly shooting and one year after a student was stabbed to death at Stag High School. Stockton police tell KCRA 3 they're working to recruit more officers. We will pay individuals to attend the police academy and they will have a police job waiting for them as soon as they graduate. That's step one. We simply need more police officers in this community. The Stockton Unified School District also wants to add to their current roster of 20 public safety officers who are assigned to the high schools. We don't have as many as we need. We, the department does do a great job and um, they know the students, they know the area, but we want more officers. We have nothing available for these kids. Community members also say there need to be more youth programs. Stockton Mayor Kevin Lincoln agrees, but says the city cannot do it alone. The only way that we're going to be able to overcome these challenges throughout our community is if we come together and if we work together. Residents like Avendano want to see that collaboration in action. I hope that we can together as a community make a change. Reporting in Stockton, Orco Mana, KCRA 3 News. Stockton City leaders also tell us that they are rolling out a $4.3 million investment program for people who are 16 to 29 years old to help them get summer jobs and potentially careers.